But I got everything. Hmm? No. Nope. I already talked to them. Oh. But I didn't notice this. I got a poke doll. I don't remember what they said. Oh. Eating your Pokemon tastes great. No! Not the Why are you just like constantly like five steps in front of where I need to go? Well, Snabalon, <laughs> I've been thinking. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try your hand at a gym challenge, right? Maybe. A gym challenge? A gym challenge, mate! The annual competition where trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge the champion. But the trick is, you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part. And Lee doesn't seem to think I'm up to snuff. So I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and see if she can help. You've got to take part too. A proper rival is just the thing every trainer needs to keep growing stronger after all. Keeps you motivated, right? The professor's house is way down at the end of Route 2, so let's head there. And give our teams a chance to train uh, up a bit along the way. We have to get stronger. That NPC looking for them stripper boots. <laughs> I'm here to rob you. <laughs> That's all I can think of with these black pants and gloves. <laughs> Shonya and Leon used to have a healthy rivalry, but... Well... You know, she wanted kids, and... It's all about the... Single life. Leon loves Pokemon. He loves Pokemon battles. I remember he would always go all out, even on practice matches, like an asshole. Basic for Pokemon trainers less than one. The Pokemon at the top of your team will be the first one to end a battle. I guess I'm not voicing anything ever again. <laughs> you're busy. Oh, I guess you're done. In order to bring out the full strength of that I Pokemon, like trainers done. must be knowledgeable. I just have to get the gum off. See that house in the distance with the purple roof? That's where the Pokemon professor lives. Yes, I can see that. What good framing. Mm -hmm. Always check every rock. Yep. See a rock that looks suspicious? Check it. Yep. Over here, Avalon. No, shut up. I saw a new Pokemon. I want to see what it is. <laughs> Alright, Avalon. It's time we filled out on our teams a bit. And I'm here to teach you how. You need to catch oh, Pokemon. Look, you, got so you got any hope of filling in that <laughs> Pokedex? Lee, where'd you come from? Only, look at you, little Avalon. You've already caught some of your own. Your mum gave you those Pokeballs, did she? I'll give you some more Pokeballs. In return, I'll only ask that you catch plenty of Pokemon. The Pokemon around here seem to easy to catch. Almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team, wouldn't you say? Yeah, but my stupid freaking brother can't Damn, catch 20. any. <laughs> Put Pokeballs in the bag. Pokemon on your team will get XP points when you catch Pokemon, too. And of course, I get XP points from battle, so take on the other trainers you meet along the uh, path to help your know, Pokemon thrive. Your team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. Yep. But even I don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, alright? Know exactly how to do what? I love balls. Oh my god. No shit, you fucking wanker. <laughs> alright, I'm gonna catch loads of Pokemon. Cressel will be shocked when she sees. Now watch as I scare them all away. Oh hey. Purloin. <laughs> I'm a burglar catching a purloin. Perfect. Good. This goes with our lore perfectly. <laughs> Oh my god. I just realized you're a floating head. I forgot. No, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> I ain't got nobody. And nobody cares. Hmm. <laughs> Is there like a black cat Pokemon? I mean, I don't know if people consider Umbreon that, but. I do. It steals things from people just to amuse itself with their frustration. A rivalry exists between this Pokemon and Nickit. Is Nickit a new black Pokemon? 
I want to know because like hmm. it's gonna decide like how I name it. But this thing evolves into. Did you take those out? Yeah, I did. Where are they? Uh, Dad has one, and I have the other one. Why? What I gave him the softer one. Yeah, I'll just name it Panther. But you, looking cool, Panther. Ooh, the fox. I've seen this thing. Oh, there's a yamper too. Oh, it looks sad and mischievous. Or mischievous, depending on how you say it. Nick it. Apparently, I say it wrong. Ah, oh, this is Nick it. Hmm. This is nicotine. Well, no. God, my hair looks so weird. It's not doing what I want it to do. Well, anyway, I was asking because if there's like a black cat, then I was gonna name that one Morgana instead. What about Truth, though? But Leopard doesn't really look like Morgana, so whatever. <laughs> that looks pretty cool with the gloves. My neck was getting hot. Any name suggestions? Hair was bugging. Otherwise, I'm probably just gonna name it Fox. Oh. Uh, are we just gonna do Persona names now? Well, it's a girl, so. Aided by the soft pads on its feet, it silently raids the food stores of other Pokemon. It survives off its ill gotten gains. Uh. Lil up. Isn't that already a Pokemon? Uh, Umbreon is the closest since Lin Rin was abandoned. Mm. Uh, freaking. What's the famous fox? Mm. Isn't there one in, like, children's rhymes that, like, steals stuff? Even though red in Animal Crossing is male, I was thinking just red, because that's what it reminds oh. me of. Yeah. Red that's fox. Uh, add to your party. I like this thing. Yeah, I'll get rid of freaking. Oh, you're already like engaging in their rivalry. Kick one out for the other one. Oh shit. Yamper. Bark. Bark. I would name it Heart Butt, but I'm pretty sure Pokemon Company wouldn't like that. No. Sorry. Maybe some other time. Oh my god, that berry looks huge. Corgis. The ones that are just corgis are Monty, Emma, Linnet, Willow, and Polly. But this was just in 2007. I don't know if this is still a thing. Um, five Pucker Spaniels, Bisto, Oxo, Flash, Spick, and Span. Spick and Span. Yeah, Spick and then also Span. And then four Dorgies, which are Dachshund, Corgi, Crossbreeds, are Cider, Berry, Vulcan, and Candy. But the ones that says they're just corgis are Monty, Emma, Linnet, Willow, and Holly. The name of the queen's first corgi um, was Susan. I think I'm gonna go with Monty. This Pokemon, Monty Python. <laughs> this Pokemon is very popular as a herding dog in the Gala region as it runs and generates electricity from the base of its tail. Is it a dude or a girl? It's a uh, bro. Bro, Monty, let's go. Gen 2 bait. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm already facing tough choices here. Mm -hmm. 
I want to use all new Pokemon, but I also want to use Big Meowth. You can use Big Meowth. You don't have to use Big Meowth right away if you don't want to, though. Mm. I'll switch in Yamper, but I think I might actually... I think I might actually uh, end up using a different one. I wish I brought water in What's there. that candlestick looking one? Whoa! Choodle. Oh, that's it's the one that evolves into the yeah, big snapping big, turtle. Yeah. Whatever it's called. It looks so goofy. Its head is like uh, as big or bigger than its body. Weird. Ow. I guess it doesn't ever fully withdraw into its shell then if its head is that frickin' big. <laughs> like, what? Power trip? What the hell? Give me the Pokemon. Hand them over. And no one gets hurt. I kinda like the snapping turtle, but if I'm being honest, I'm kinda meh. Apparently, the Why? itch of its teething impels it to snap its jaws at anything in front of it. Like a child? Like a toddler? Wait, was it a girl or a boy? It says right there. Oh, yeah. Okay. Neon! Leonardo, let's go. Wait, is that the one with the orange? No. Blue. Then shouldn't you have named it the one with the orange? Well, it was blue. But it had, like, orange hair and stuff. Eh. Yeah, all this flavor goes away. Is that one of the squirrels? I can't tell. Rookie dookie. I probably should have figured Wooloo didn't have much in the way of attack moves. Yeah, I don't know if Seems pretty strong though. Yeah. Michelangelo. Yeah. Yeah, I remembered after I said it because Mikey. Remember? Mikey! Raphael is cool but rude. Michelangelo is a party dude. Party! Ninja Turtle. I'm pretty sure it's just the squirrel. Probably. It looks like a squirrel. Yep. Shkabirl. I already have a shkabirl. I don't need another shkabirl. Then destroy it. And its whole family. I will. Over here, facing my. Oh, we have this thing. Oh no, this one's all weird. What do you mean all weird? Oh, it's like crushed. It got crushed and melted. It looks like a tumor. <laughs> Why? It's like that. Oh, and my chocolate. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. A trainer. <gasps> it's a freaking punk kid. Kill him. 
Are you not legally allowed to do that yet? <laughs> Am I not l l legally allowed to punch a kid? I guess not. <laughs> Can you punch your Pokemon? How many is it? Care 20. Eh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's probably a waste, but... Might as well have a trump card. It's common madness for Pokemon trainers to battle when their eyes meet. Yeah, well, give me your Pokemon, punk. Ooh. I had to get it everywhere. It's freaking impossible. It's like... It's <gasps> What? That's what May is apparently calling. The squirrels. Oh, okay. Cool. S Squovit? Squovit. I have not been calling it by its name, no, so I no, didn't no. even remember what it was called. Squovit. I can't actually see our HP, but... We're okay. A little less than half. I mean, just tell me to move, and I'll move. <laughs> floating head. You're a talking head. Well, that was pointless. <laughs> what was? I raised my defense, and then it lowered my defense. Hmm. So then nothing happened. Which is better than your defense falling a lot. He's just gonna spam that. Yeah, what an idiot. I know what'll win this fight. Tail whip. Yeah. Oh, but use tail whip. I wasn't taught anything else. Whenever there's a strong trainer, I always look right at them and then tail whip. <laughs> good. I whip my tail back and forth. You don't want to battle. It's important to make sure you aren't seen by other people when you're walking around. What, is there an invisibility cloak or something? You gonna give me one? Or... Oh, I'm all about not being seen, you know, breaking into people's homes and whatnot. Yeah. Freaking mobster robber. What you look like? Oh my look at, look at yeah, it. I get it. Look at how sad it looks. I'm worried to like tear up my mouth. <laughs> but I already opened the door. Oh, it's time to do it. God, it's a turtle. Should have got a male Nicket and named it Arson. Yeah. Mm. Maybe. Oh shit, it knows Bite too. They're just biting each other. Good. I mean, when it evolves, does it look more like Arson? Because <laughs> the default, or the first stage, doesn't really. But yeah, I could see it evolving into more thief looking. Pickle bugs who want to kill you. Yes. Oh. You gonna hide from here? You gonna walk around there? Or are you gonna fight it? 
<laughs> I didn't actually mean to run right in front of her, but cute and strong and together in combination. It's from the meme! Yep. You should have done the accent! I wanna have a cheeky little Pokemon fight. <laughs> Now already, and you're like, what is your character saying? <laughs> I'm more, uh, you think I'm on the fucking XP share? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I am. Yeah. Just keep biting. Use them jaws. I mean, you could put us on the other side, but then we would fuck them in. Do I need to move, like, every time? Nah, it's fine. I might adjust it later, but it's fine for now. Our cute, and nothing more. Looks like our strength still has a ways to go. Uh, well, here's your first tip. Uh, catch more than one fucking Pokemon. <laughs> How dare you! It's, it's, it's her oh, still. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Pokemon have types! Pokemon have types! Fire is strong against grass, grass is strong against water, and water is strong against fire. Remember that, and you'll get really strong! Yeah, and you are strong against me not being bored. <laughs> Couldn't beat Hop, but I'm gonna beat you. Didn't we already fight you? That was my twin brother. Okay. Rat, ratty. <laughs> I'm. Go. Oh my god, that. What Freaky. is that? <laughs> that is terrifying. What am I looking at? Blip bug. You <laughs> lost a hop? Wow, you are a disappointment. Yep. That thing looks like Al looks like it's from Alice in Wonderland and wants to die. Ha, <laughs> get flinched on. Maybe try catching more than one shitty bug. Is that really all he has? Yep. No. Oh, no, he has a nicot- I could've swore- he has a nicotine. I could've swore he only had one. Oh, it is a dark type. Mm. Got its own legs. Like it's an octopus or something. The way it moves around. On the ground, you see. Damn. Or like a What's the base with? power of quick attack? Mm. Probably more than tackle. Lose to wild Pokemon, lose to many trainers, oh, lose to everyone. You got 420 for winning. Pokemon hiding in the tall grass of trainers waiting along the route. Which one you choose is up to you. Oop, shinies. Hmm? <laughs> what did I even run into? It's pale, huh? Probably check what type he is. Just flying. Okay. Man, it does say on there already. Effective. 
Don't stare me. Always. What's with all these crits? Everything's critting me. Parts of you up. little tie forces. Don't know. Yeah. Time for me to do a sit. Yeah. Think about all your winnings. Think about what I've done. All the things I've stolen. Ooh! Can you like interact with that? I don't know. I don't have a fishing rod yet. Wait, I do. Hell. I just have a yeah. fishing rod already. Let's go. It's in your mom's bag. But it's just one of these again. Mm. Five. It's just like a weird floating hand. Oh no. Oh, he lived. Yeah, let's go. We living. And it's paralyzed. With one HP, God. Look at your little heart butt. Let's go, Monty. Oops. Nuzzle the shit out of that thing. Yeah. Monty and, uh... Tix. <laughs> are, are gonna be the MVPs, I can feel it. Mm. Electric types are usually pretty good. Honestly, though, one of the few, like, old Pokemon that I'd want to use is Rotom. Yeah. You and Chris again? Or... Nah. I don't really need to save. I haven't really noticed it auto-saving, but... Oh, I, I know it has been. Look, there's the professor! So, have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Just no. The whole thing seemed full of questions. I'd hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but she's too busy chasing boys. Well, one boy in particular. When are you going to make an honest woman out of my granddaughter? I'm here to rob you. Me? <laughs> even me? I'm sorry. I didn't even notice my guests. Of course it is. Of course it is. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. Yes, uh, show me where you keep your things. <laughs> Bye. Oh dear, I see Hulu has made some new friends. And you must be Avalon. <laughs> I've heard things about <laughs> you. <laughs> I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonia. I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. I'm probably butchering this. You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, Avalon? Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years. And it takes proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. There you go again, Leon. Always talking about Pokemon. I mean, goddamn, I'm a Pokemon professor and I don't even talk about them as much as you. There are other things that are worth knowing about, too, you know. Like, 
how many different types of tea there are. Hey, Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon. Why wouldn't you endorse him? Hop and Avalon only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads they don't know yet. Deary, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Gala region become strong trainers. Isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goal is precisely the reason I give them both Pokemon, in fact. Right then, in that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both of your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. The placement of his hand was kind of <laughs> questionable. Right! I'll be waiting outside, Avalon. Here, here, wait. Wait, lady. Let me heal you. No! <laughs> Uh, so any, uh, grabbed, safes or, uh... He grabbed, grabbed your titties. What? Squee! Look, look, look on the mantle. Do what plants would want instead of what you want. If you keep that in mind, plants will grow. And I do so love my herbs. <laughs> now remember, be sure to give it everything you bought. That's the best thing you can do for your Pokemon. And for yourself, too. Sorry, I'm just keep saying away. Am I ruining the sound with my nah. gun? And pops, I'm sorry. Hair dryer and barrel hairbrush have been left lying around without being put away. I want something for my throat. Meow. Meow. Look at the stickers! sketches and photos pinned up. Yeah. Go back to the herbs. No, go back to go back to the greenhouse. I want to see if there's any that look like weed. <laughs> I got stuff to do. Hurry up, Avalon. You gotta battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. Why does everybody just have a battle mat in the front of their house? They just like it. I'm gonna become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is. Mm -hmm. And to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee what, uh, that we've got what it takes. Of course. I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. Listen you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. So show me something good in this battle. Or else. It's time for my legend to begin. Time, time to take his heart. If only I could Dynamax outside of gyms and just mm. like come at him with a friggin' meow. We've gotten a bit stronger. Me and my team are weak as hell Rock. and suck. I'm pretty sure there's rules so you know, people don't go destroy villages with their giant ass Pokemon. Squirrel. <laughs> Good squirrel. Wow, level 8. Get good, kid. Is... Have a taste of our true power. Our green power just keeps on growing stronger. What is Trix right now? Oh no, he poked me. Trix is like 13. How is that? How is what? How am I? How high is this blue? 11. Damn. He's about to get what? ass blasted. To the past? Yep. Or like the fourth dimension. Oh, I do hear it now. I hear the friggin' Mario and Luigi. <laughs> Look at you, it seems you've really learned your type matchups. 
I really fucked up picking this monkey. <laughs> yep, yep, you did, bro. You're a disgrace to your whole family. Double Dishonor on you. Dishonor on your Wooloo. Get it? Yeah. Laugh, so It'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sort of match. Um, how close do you think it's close? Cause... You literally just caught this thing. You're screwed, my guy. Yeah. Solder on you! Solder on your milk tank! <laughs> yes. Oof, gutted that I lost, but I'd expect nothing less from my rival. Okay. Is that you're gonna give up, or...? Please do. <laughs> I even got my Pokeball throw perfect, too. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory, which I've never tasted. I guess going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Yeah, I guess. So you're gonna endorse me and not this scrub, right? Avalon, Hop! Well, after seeing a match like that one... I'm horribly disappointed in you, Hop. I'm disowning you. <laughs> I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. I mean, I really don't want to give it to you, Hop, but, you know, I have to. Because I'm related to you. You're obtaining a letter of endorsement. Put the letter of endorsement in your bag, this key item in this pocket. What is it? It almost kind of looked like an ice cream cone or something. What? Now I see it. Tell him he's pants at battling. Do it. Yes, thanks Lee. I swear I'm going to win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Just to reach you. You may both Just be young still you. and plenty rough around the edges, but oh. it was a proper battle. Charizard and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our bodies. Whoa. Hop, you've already tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out. Yeah. Things that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I've been worried about you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense. But it seems you really have grown a bit, little brother. I mean, you're taller. You I'd still like suck. I'd like to see some but... more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you too, Avalon. All right, Avalon, you and me are going to train up against one another to aim for that champion's title. Against one another? <laughs> Please. Absolutely. Absolutely. The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Huh? What's that? I just shit my pants. He gets scared way too easily. <laughs> Shooting star. Yeah. Avalon, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take one yourself. If there weren't two of them, were you gonna give us one? Because you kind of like didn't even give us a chance to go see what a it was. A stone found in the Galar region with a mysterious power. It's said that your dreams come true if you find one. Wish one of these Excuse my Pokemon uh, with one of these my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be massive. Yes. Oh God. <laughs> so if we hadn't been in this exact location yeah. where a fucking shooting star just randomly decided to fall, yeah. we would not be able to Dynamax. Nope. Okay. Yep. It's magic. Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know? I'll be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever! <laughs> there, I've said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Oh, that's me. I was trying to figure out. Jirachi says hi. Don't be silly. You fucking suck. 
door switching stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Galar region. But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now, and I'll have you sorted. All oh, right, you've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Bessa? Then please give Avalon and me the power to Dynamax our Pokémon. First, we got a battle against that mad Pokémon in the slumbering wield, and now this. It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man. But don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. <laughs> she had that. She was here. Mm -hmm. She had that. She was like, <laughs> Seems I came back home the right in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot. Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. Oh, that sounds so good right now. 